You're legally staying in Poland and you wonder what you can do to stay longer. You've found the right place. You will learn here how to apply for a temporary residence permit. The temporary residence permit is the primary means by which a foreigner can extend their legal stay in Poland. There are many types of temporary residence permits, depending on the primary purpose of your stay in Poland. The purpose of stay you have indicated must be documented and should, in principle, justify the need to stay in Poland for a period longer than three months. This can be, among others, work, business activity, studies, or stay with your family. To obtain the permit, you need to go through an administrative procedure consisting of several essential steps. Step 1. Preparing to submit the application. Before filling in the application, please specify the main purpose of your stay and get acquainted with the specific requirements for that purpose. Learn about relevant legal provisions. In particular, those related to obstacles to the initiation of the proceedings and granting the permit. Useful information can be found at mos.sudzoziemce.gov.pl. An example of an obstacle to granting a temporary residence permit is illegal stay in Poland. Prepare all the necessary attachments for each application. Travel document, four biometric photographs, and documents confirming that the indicated purpose justifies your stay, as well as documents confirming the fulfillment of the requirements for granting the temporary residence permit. Before submitting your application, pay the required administrative fee. Fill the applications completely, preferably electronically, for example, at mos.sudzoziemce.gov.pl fill the application in Polish. You can use the help of an interpreter or a trusted person. Remember that providing false information and data will lead to application being rejected. If you have any doubts about filling out the form, please clarify them before submit it. Second step, submission of the application. Applications for a temporary residence permit must be submitted in person at the Voivodeship office no later than on the last day of your legal residence in Poland. Please do not wait until the last minute. Most Voivodes provide online registration to set up appointments needed in order to submit an application. Please arrange your visit in advance. If there are no appointments available, please send your application by post or submit it at the Voivode's registry office. In such case, the Voivode will order you to appear at the office within a specified time period. If you do not comply, your application will not be processed. This means that the Voivode will not initiate the procedure for granting the permit. During the visit at the office, you will be asked to present the travel document, and the photos attached to the application will be checked. You will be asked to submit your fingerprints too. If it turns out that your application has formal deficiencies, for example, contains no photographs or required attachments, you will be able to remedy them, as requested by the Voivode by post. Incomplete applications will not be processed. Complete set of documents submitted in a timely manner guarantees a legal stay in Poland until the end of the procedure. Voivode will put a special stamp on your passport for the duration of the procedure. The stamp is not the equivalent of a visa or residence permit and does not authorize you to travel abroad. During the procedure, you can return to your country. When returning to Poland, however, you will have to fulfill the entry conditions. Step 3. Processing the application. Different purposes require different supporting documents. Check which documents should be attached to your application. If the submitted set of documents is incomplete, you will be ordered, in writing, to supplement the missing documentation. All documents submitted must be valid, written in Polish or supplied together with a certified translation. Originals or certified copies are required. You have the right to participate in the whole procedure, including reading your case file. 
Step 4. Procedure completed. Time for a decision. The Voyevode will take a decision. If it is positive, that is, you are granted a permit, you will also be issued a document called a residence permit that confirms the legality of stay, allows you to enter Poland with passport, without a visa, and travel within the Schengen area for a specified period of time. If your application is rejected, you can file an appeal within 14 days to the head of the office for foreigners through the Voivode who has taken this decision. You can submit an appeal in the Voivode's registry office or send it by post. Please substantiate the reason for disagreeing with the decision and attach documents showing that the Voivode has issued an incorrect decision. Add any missing documents if some of the documents have expired. Provide their current versions. The head of the office for foreigners may uphold the decision of the Voivode. If the original decision was negative, you have 30 days to leave Poland unless you are entitled to further stay in the country. The decision may also be revoked and remitted for reconsideration by the Voivode. In such case, the Voivode will initiate procedure once again. Head of the office foreigners can also give you a temporary residence permit. Before submitting an application for a residence permit, refer to the information available at udsc.gov.pl mos.sudzoziemce.gov.pl Be sure to check the information on the websites of the Voivodeship offices, visit customer service centers, or call the selected Voivodeship office.